Play the welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be showing you guys how you can get a custom battle bus for free in Fortnite Battle Royale. So the things you're going to need is the battle bus folder, Fortnite and HXC. All of the links for that will be in the description as well as my Discord so you can download them and join the giveaway. Apart from that guys, I hope you enjoyed the tutorial. Peace. Okay guys, so now you've downloaded everything, the first thing you want to do is open the battle bus and you're going to have four folders. This is for the static bus that parks on the island. You have the front of the bus, the body and the balloon. I'm going to start with the balloon. I'm going to right click the TGA and open it with Photoshop. Okay, now Photoshop is opened, you want to do any customizations you want. I'm just going to put a sim uh, simple hue shift on it and make it a purplish colour. Now I've done that, I'm going to go to File, Save As, PNG, and name it Bloom. Uh, Bloom. What? PNG, I don't care if I saw that one. Now that's done, you wait for it to save. Okay, now save, you want to close Photoshop, click No, and delete TJ. I'm going to speed this next part up, but you want to do the same with the rest of them, or do any customizations you want. The fuck's going on? I got a new single coming out next October, it's about to drop out this pants, it's called Squibbers and Nose, bitch. Smoking good. Okay guys, so now it's finished, you want to delete the TGA again, and now you want to open up Unreal Engine. This will take a while to load, so I'll be back if you want to load it. Okay guys, now Unreal Engine is open, you want to go back to your balloon and drag in the PNG into Unreal Engine. Then go to the body and drag the PNG in. Then you want to go to the front and drag the PNG in. And then last, the static. Now you use it all in here, you want to click save all and click save selected. I'm going to go to file and cook content for windows. This will take a while to cook, but once it's cooked, I'll be back. Okay guys, now the cooking is complete, you want to close Unreal Engine, and now open up the folder to where your project has been created. Mine is in here, you want to click saved, cooked, windows no editor, my project, content, and now I'll be left with these. You want to drag the u box for the balloon, the base, the basic, and the front on your desktop. And now you want to close down your folder. And now you're going to want to open up back the battle bus, get a balloon, and drag in the U bulk, the body, the front, and the static. Now you're going to align these all up. So this one here is the base, this one here is the front, this one here is the basic. Okay, guys, now you've done this, you want to open up HXD. You're going to want to go to File, Open, and now select the right pack. Okay guys, so you want to open up Patchunk S1, and now drag in the first two U-Bolts. So you want to drag down five lines, go into the pack chunk, click Control F, and now paste it in the search for it. Once you've done that, you want to click OK, and it's going to search for it. Now I've found that you want to click one before the dot, go back to the U-Bolt, the original one, click Control A, Control E, deck and now copy this. Once you've done that you want to go back to the pack, click Control E, deck and paste it in the length and then click OK. Now we'll select the whole area, you want to go to the balloon.ubulk, do Control A, Control C and paste it in the area. Now I've done that you can close down the two U-Bulks and open up the next two while I'm dragging them in. Now from the base you want to drag down five lines, search, go back to the top in the pack Search for it in the hex values and now wait for it to find it. Once it's found it, you want to click one before the highlighted area, go back to the underscore D, control A, control E, deck, highlight this and click control C, go back to the pack, do control E, deck, and put it in the length. It will highlight the whole area again and now you want to go back to the base, control A, control C and paste it. Once you've done that, you can close the D and the base and now you want to repeat it for the next two. Once you've done that, you want to click save and it's going to take you to the backup. You don't have to do this, but it is recommended. I'm going to click cancel and yes. Now I'm going to close this and open up Fortnite. Okay guys, once Fortnite is loaded, you want to click Fortnite Battle Royale and now let Battle Royale load. 
Okay, yeah, now it's loaded. You want to select any game mode you want. I'm going to click solos. And now you want to click play. Wait for the game to load in and you should have a custom battle bus. Okay guys, now you have loaded in, you want to find the battle bus. I'm going to search for the battle bus over here. I will not be able to see the static one, but the static one is the bus that sits on the floor over there somewhere. I cannot quite see it from here, but they're over there. And now guys, you can see the battle bus has changed as well as the balloon. So that guys is how you make custom battle buses in Fortnite Battle Royale. I don't think this will kick you from the bus, it's going to kick me either way as I'm hardware banned. But guys, if you have enjoyed this tutorial, make sure you leave a like, subscribe and put post notifications on so you know when I do my next tutorials. Uh, apart from that guys, I'll see you on the next one. Peace.